Hello everybody, I'm so glad to see you on today. I wanted to share a quick message with you um, that derived from our prayer on last night, Monday night prayer, was absolutely phenomenal. I can't speak for anyone else, but for me, I truly enjoyed um, being on the line with everyone from all over um, that came to touch and agree. Um, but I want to talk with you today about the scripture um, that was given to us from the book of Proverbs 3 and 5. Um, as the Bible reads, it tells us to trust in the Lord with all our heart and lean not on our own understanding, but in all our ways acknowledge him and he will direct our pathway. Um, I know that there are a lot of people out here, including myself. Sometimes we have issues or trouble, um, sometimes trusting God or leaning on God and really finding out which way he wants us to go in the midst of a circumstance, in the midst of a trial or a situation. And it's hard. It's hard. It's not always an easy task when we say, trust God. Just trust him. Uh, God is going to do it. Um, no worries or just have faith. And we just throw it out there um, expecting for you to grasp it or catch it or feel like, okay, in this situation, it's going to really be done. Um, our belief is built. Our faith is watered. Our faith is, 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 is watered because the Bible talks about us having a mustard seed of faith. And so in order for a seed to grow, it has to be watered. And so sometimes situations are going to come that's going to water that faith. Um, God is going to take li literally the living water, the living water of his word, his promises, and all that he said concerning you, he's going to water that faith. And through that faith being watered, things are going to happen for you. Things are going to spring up. And so in trusting in the Lord with all of our heart, I tell you today, it may not be an easy task, but as you trust God in your situation, as you trust God for what you're believing him for, um, sometimes it's, the situations are not always bad. Sometimes we're making a decision as it relates to business. Do I sign this contract? Do I connect with this business partner? Um, do I move forward in this ministry venture? Um, do I move forward in this business venture? Um, what should I do with my kids? Do I take them out of this school? Do I put them in another school? We have decisions in our daily lives that we must make. And sometimes in those making those decisions, we don't know sometimes how to trust God. Sometimes it's not as easy and we think we're trusting, um, but sometimes we're being led by what it is we wanna do. I tell you today, don't look at things logically. Don't try to figure God out. Don't try to figure the situation out. Relax, have peace. So I declare the peace of the Lord in your life today and that you would be still and know that he is God. That's the word of the Lord. Be still and know that he is God. So sometimes it's not always about making a move, but sometimes it has to do with you just saying, I'm going to stay right here. I'm going to lay back and really see, you know, what it is the Lord wants me to do. And I know that he's going to show me. He's going to reveal to me. God is going to reveal. He's going to open things up. And it's going to be as if you don't have to figure things out. It's going to be made plain and clear as we trust in the Lord with all of our heart and lean not on our own understanding, but in all our ways. We shall acknowledge you, God, and you will surely direct our pathway. May God bless each and every one of you. Um, meditate on this scripture this week. Pray on this scripture this week. Reach out to someone and let them know I'm standing in agreement with you and everything is going to be okay. God bless each and every one of you, and I can't wait to speak with you guys soon. Bye.